Hello, this is an Astroneer tutorial about input and output priority. So what exactly is input and output priority? It's basically where the game decides to put resources and where the game decides to pull resources from. Um, so if you have a module that say the uh, smelting furnace and it's going to pull things, it's going to pull resources into it, it's going to pull from a specific location first and then secondary locations and so on and so forth. It's, it's, it's a specific priority in which uh, objects pull. We're going to flip that around and start with output. For output, meaning where modules and canisters try to put finished resources, it's going to be the, the canister and modules have the highest priority. Then it's any of the uh, storage containers. Uh, these are all the same priority with the exception that if the game decides to put it on a large storage, it will put it on an attached medium storage if there is one first. And then finally, it will put to uh, the base platform. So, and, and then again, it's the reverse for the pull. It's gonna pull from the base platform. It's gonna pull from um, it, 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 the same priority for all three of, of the storage platforms, uh, with the exception that it'll pull from this first if it's attached to the large uh, uh, storage, and then it'll pull from modules and canisters. Uh, that doesn't really happen because canisters put automatically and so do modules. But for examples of this, so we have this here. If I turn this on, it's an almost complete carbon. It's going to put it to the right. But if I put a medium storage on the left, the medium storage is going to take priority and the carbon will be deposited to the left. And then this shows that the canister has the highest priority of all. It just goes straight into the canister. Um, and then it's the same thing with the pull priority. So if I take this and put it on here, well, it's going to first uh, pull these two and then it's going to pull from, from the platform because the pull priority is it's, it goes from the base to the uh, storage, to the canister. So see, it pulled f two from there and two from the storage. Um, this priority works the same for all, all the modules that can push and pull. So soil centrifuge, uh, chemistry lab, uh, canisters, uh, atmosphere condensers, and the shredder, they all use this put pull priority to um, to determine where they're going to put resources. At this point, you may be asking, what happens if you have two storages on the same platform? How will the game pick where to put stuff? And that gets into platform priority. So with platform priority, the game for every single platform, there is a specific order in which it pushes or puts and pulls resources. So if I put this on here and turn it on, it's going to put to the middle right, then it's going to try and put to the middle left, but the canister's there, so it's going to skip that. It's going to then put to the far right, and then the far left. So here, if I uh, flip the canister, you can see that it's going to pull from the far left, then the far right, then the middle right. The strange thing about platform priority is that the pull and push do not mirror each other. So here's an example of how that works. So if I put the canister here and uh, set it to deposit, it's going to put it on the middle right, then the middle left, then the far left. But when I pull resources into it, it's going to pull from the far left then the middle right, then the middle left. So it's slightly different in the middle of the platform. So here are some examples of the platform priority. We have the smelter in the middle and a canister on the left. Because the pull priority goes far left, far right, and then middle, 
the canister is going to pick up uh, anything I place on this far right section of the platform. And there we go. They're all going into the canister. And another example of the put priority. So because because the put priority goes middle, then far right, then far left, it's going to pick the rightmost of this platform every single time it deposits the carbon. So I'm going to wait for this next one, and you're going to see that it goes to the right. All right, so a better demonstration of this is with these large platform platforms. So we're going to show two examples of this. Um, here's the first one where this canister is going to deposit to the medium storage on the large storage, then the large storage, then the medium storage on the platform itself. But if I put this canister over here and I flip the large platform and the uh, storage on the base platform, it's going to use the platform priority to prioritize the medium storage that's directly on the platform and then go to the large storage. That's the way platform priority affects where resources get put. So, and just a side note of example here, are two ways to automate the smelter. You can have an input on the left and an output on the right. And if you want to reverse that, you could just put a medium storage on the left and it will always prioritize the medium storage and you'll get reverse of direction. All right, for this last portion of the video, I'm just gonna go over the uh, platform put-pull priorities for uh, some of the common platforms that you may be using when you're trying to automate stuff. For the large platform B, the put priority is middle right, then middle left, then far right, then far left. The pull priority is going to be far, far left, then far right, then middle right, then middle left. So again, slightly different. For the large platform C, it's a little strange. I can't tell the priority of the middle section because you have to put a canister on it to actually output stuff. But the strange part is, is the right side fills up with eight and then it starts filling up the other side, the left side with eight. Um, and then it kind of goes back and forth. So it, it's, you can't really fill up one side entirely with the um, medium plat or the large platform C and the pull priority of the side seems to be an exact reverse of the put priority. For the large platform T, the output priority is top in the circle, bottom in the circle, then far right and mid right. And for the input priority, it is far right, mid right, then top in the circle, bottom in the circle. For the extra large platform C, it goes forward mid left, rear mid left, forward mid right, rear mid right, forward far right, rear far right, forward far left, rear far left. And the input priority is forward far left, rear far left, forward far right, rear far right, forward mid left, rear mid left, forward mid right, rear mid right. And the final platform we're gonna do is the extra large curved platform, which goes all the way to the right, mid right, then mid left, then far left, and then center. And the input priority is center, then mid left, then far left, then far right, then mid right. So that's gonna be it for this video. Um, I hope this information was useful. Uh, if I've gotten anything wrong or if anything is confusing, please let me know in the comments down below so I can fix it because I want this to be uh, as complete as possible. That is it. Thank you for watching.